Okay, today is the 19th, I do believe. Let me verify that for sure, because it could be the 20th. No, it's the 20th of June, 2010. And we got problems with the neighbors mowing into our yard, because they have a foot inset from the fence, which you can barely see the fence post from there. But you can tell that they're way inside here. And we've already talked to the police once. And I believe if this is going to be a continuous thing, that I'm just going to have to file charges. Because this is not, you know, the yard's mowed. You can see that the yard's been mowed recently. And it looks nice you compared to this. You know, I, I'm not expecting a whole lot other than somebody to learn how to use the lawnmower because they use a riding lawnmower for this dinky yard. You know, it takes an hour at most to do the whole, probably that whole yard if you're doing it slow. But this is ridiculous. This is uncalled for. I thought we had this worked out and apparently we didn't. And I'm documenting this. And I verifying it because I'm definitely going to be calling the police again because they were told to stop this nonsense and as you can tell they're way inside the property mark and it's the principle of the thing you know I don't mind them doing a little bit but this is way too much if the person doesn't know how to operate the piece of equipment they don't need to be running it this is way inside the property mark. You know, and it damages our yard. It screwed up the drainage. You, you can you can see it just shoved a, all that grass I pulled out of there. Right here. So you know what I'm talking about. And there's drainage right there. You can see the open hole. You can actually turn it right here and you can see the, the drain. You know, we're trying to make things a lot better for everybody, and this is not how I expect to be repaid. I expect to be treated in a just manner, and if I'm not going to be treated in a just manner, then we'll just take it to court. It does not make me any difference one bit. I'm not going to keep wasting my time with these people. You know, I'm trying to deal with everybody justly and if we have a problem on our end we try to fix it as quickly as possible once we know that there's a problem and you know it's just damaged the yard you know you could tell it's not as green over there as it is over here there's a reason for that because we're not killing the grass you know I expect to be able to do what I want to do and not have somebody think that I'm not mowing my grass so they're just gonna tear up my yard you know because I'm the one that has to mow this thing keep this thing up but I'm just giving you all a good look at it because I'm tired of this you know I, I have enough to deal with with other encroachments on my freedom and my property I'm not gonna put up with no more you know, we dealt with this, and apparently she's forgotten, and she needs to be reminded. But you can see in the shadows there. I want to make sure everybody sees this, so they're not just saying, Oh, AJ, you're just making a big, bigger deal out of it than what it is. This is called damaging property. You know, I've asked her to stop. I've asked them to stop because this isn't how you treat your neighbor and expect to get proper treatment back. You know, I can understand if we had grass 20 feet high or, or 20 inches high or something, but the city sa says as long as it's below 12 inches, it's fine. You know, we dealt with this. You know, I already have enough to deal with. I don't need to deal with no more. So, this is going on.